problem. Hold in, you pal. Grab a cover. Let me see you.
Switching that ammo.
to the money plates that Sal Marcano stole from the Federal Reserve. I don't recall. Georgie, get your ass in here. Your Uncle Tommy's dead. I thought you'd like to know. Sorry, Pops. I, oh, man, I know what he meant to you. And... He was a smart kid, your Uncle Tommy. Could have been anything. I tried to tell him, go to college. Even offered to pay for it. <laughs> Instead, he went to Cuba. It's not your fault. Yeah. Well, we're pretty well fucked now, you understand? I, mean, I was counting on that counterfeit money without him. Yeah. Well, now there's got to be something we can do. You go put the squeeze on people. Get to increase what they're kicking up. It ain't gonna be enough. Just because you poke holes in someone doesn't mean you're gonna get anything extra out of them. You could always call Leo Galanti. Ask him to front... Fuck him! The whole reason I'm building this goddamn casino is to get out from under them worthless fucks. Now I bring in the commission, they're gonna wanna cut everything. God damn it. Go on, get the hell out of here. I gotta make a call. Get out! Shit. Leo! <laughs> How the fuck are you? It's Sal. Yeah? L listen, I, I got something I need to discuss. I tried to reconcile the part of me that helped Lincoln with the part of me that vowed to follow the teachings of Jesus Christ. But I can't. You know what I remember? I remember watching the news and learning they had gunned down Dr. King. I remember watching people lash out, riot, because that's all they had left. All the while, Lincoln's in the other room, barely clinging to life. Maybe that's why I did what I did. We've wasted enough time. Let's go. South Downs belongs to us. Tommy was smart and set up some solid, low-key rackets there. Should be a smooth transition for us. Twice in a row now you come to my guys asking them to lock down a district. Only last time, you gave the district to someone else. I would strongly suggest things don't go that way this time. Let me just say, I ain't here to convince you of shit, brother. Twice in a row now, you've chosen someone else over me. And now, you don't even need my help locking the turf down. 
So I think it's about time you convince me why I should even be here. And you can do that by giving me this piece of the city. Whoever you call to lock down the auction is up to you, and I respect that. But now, you're talking long-term responsibility. You trusted me with the last piece of the city. No reason to not trust me with this one as well. It feels like a knife is being twisted in my fucking back. Sammy raised you right, lad. Trust your instincts. If this table can't handle me, make it known, brother. Don't forget who you're dealing with, Lincoln. Calling this one for Scaletta. No, no. I can't believe I ever let you talk me into this. I'm not just gonna sit here and allow you to lie to my fucking face. Hey, hey! I know you're used to your little Haitian boys bowing to your every whim, but that shit don't work around here, Cassandra. So cool it. My patience, my understanding, it's gone, Lankin. You correct this course we own, or there ain't no words that can walk us back from where we headed. We're all after the same thing, Cassandra. Mixing it up between us isn't getting us anywhere. You've said your piece, Cassandra. Let it go. I'm sure things didn't break the way some of you were expecting, but this is the way I think things should run. <laughs>